Hey guys, what's up? Uh, right now, um, I'm going to be showing you a video pretty much how I work from my home studio when it comes to mixes. So pretty much what happens is, is that like um, I'll open up my Pro Tools session and um, I'll work on the song and on everything um, and so forth. And as you can see, I have all my faders up and so forth. And the first thing I try to do when I mix a record is have everything color-coded and labeled properly. I can't tell you how much that saves a lot of time when it comes to mixing a record. So always make sure that your uh, tracks are color-coded. So that way, like, if I want to fix something, like, I know red is drums. I go right into there. And then pretty much, um, you know, I'll work on the song, and if I feel like it's ready... If if I feel like it's good enough to send it out, I'll print the I'll print the um I'll print the mix and send it to him. What's great about working in the box is that as you can see right here, I've got you know m three mixes I've done so far, and I could do them I could do them simultaneously, and um I could I could check each one in instantly without having to take forever to recall it, and then pretty much what will happen is um. Right after I send the mixes, I will um, I'll tell my client to send me an email of all the notes that all the changes they want. So here's a perfect example. Uh, Chris Rogers sent me this. Uh, usual notes like you know uh, like perfect example. Uh, please replace the buzzing guitar chords at eight seconds, three minutes and twenty three seconds, and three minutes and fifty nine seconds. And another one would be like uh, add more reverb to the uh, background vox. He wants more of a chamber slash cathedral type sound of an echo, so I'll, I could do that for him easily. So this this has changed my workflow so drastically. Not only I could work faster, but I feel like my mixes have become a lot better because I'm I'm not stuck with one mix. You know, mixing on the on the uh, console. Once you put those faders back to zero, you have to you know you have to start from scratch. And it could take all day to recall a, uh, a session that you that you did recently on a console. So the idea of me going back to the to the console, I probably will never do it ever again. Ever since I got into this, and like I said, the technology is so good to the point where my clients can't even tell the difference. And I could literally be in my pajamas and mix a record now, which is great. I could just do it whenever. I'm not on the, I'm not on the time frame. If I want to start at 5 o'clock in the afternoon, I could start at 5 o'clock in the afternoon as long as I get it done that day. Anyway, just wanted to give you a little uh, video of how my workflow works. And you guys have a wonderful day. Bye.